I am Anil Kumar and I have selected some very good questions from previous test papers on radian measurements, trigonometry. Question number 1a. Determine the angle theta rounded to the nearest tenth of a degree. Diagram is given to you. So in this we are given radius of 12 centimeters, arc length of 32 centimeters and that's the angle theta which we need to find. Now in these set of questions, I'd like you to pause the video, answer the question and then look into my suggestion. Take it as a review for your own test. That way it's going to help you a lot, right? Now to answer questions related to arc, length, radius and theta, we should always work with the relation A equals to R theta, right? Remember that theta should be in radians that is very important whenever you use a equals to r theta now in this case you should make a note that says round it to nearest tenth of a degree so the answer which you are going to get will be in radians you have to convert that to degree and then round it to nearest tenth that is the critical part and should not be overlooked right otherwise the question is straightforward we are given here arc length of 32 centimeters, radius is 12 centimeters and so we can write theta as equals to A over R which is 32 centimeter divided by 12 centimeter, right? So that gives you, we can always use the calculator and 32 divided by 12 centimeters cancel we get 2.666 as our answer for, I mean, I should not have written theta here, 2.666, let me, let me write x here first, okay. So it is this angle x which we are talking about, not the angle theta which we wanted to measure, okay. So it is actually 2.666 recurring, correct. So that is the answer we get for this angle, but theta should be how much? So the theta the angle will be actually 2 pi minus x, right? Minus x. So let's use your calculator. Find 2 pi minus x. So we'll do, uh, rather we can do minus 2 times shift pi. So we'll get 3.6165. So what we get is 3.6165 as our answer as far as the radians are concerned. So this is in radians actually, okay? Or we need to find to the nearest tenth of a degree. To find theta in degrees, what should you do? You have to do 3.6165 radians. You have to multiply by 180 degrees divided by pi radians, correct? To get the exact answer. So let's do that part now. So we'll multiply this by 180 and divide this by pi. So you get 207.211, correct? Forget the negative sign. Since I did this reverse, we have negative in the calculator, right? So that is your answer in degrees, which when rounded to the 10th place, you will get as 207. point to one degrees right so these are the steps to be followed now I would like you to go through these steps once again so that you understand the whole process so let's go through them so first thing is make a note that you need to give answer in degrees that to round it to tenth place and the angle is that exterior kind of an angle not that interior angle so let us assume that the interior or subtended angle is x. That angle can be calculated using the ratio of arc length to radius. And then you take away this angle from 2 pi to get the angle required. That value is in radius, radians, and then convert radians to degree to write down your final answers. So that becomes the answer for us. I hope it's clear, right? So thank you and all the best.